Hey guys, Michael from Kind of Chemistry. In today's video, we'll be covering how to convert between degrees Celsius and degrees Kelvin, which are two different units of temperature. The formal equation is as such: degrees Celsius, degrees Kelvin is equal to degrees Celsius plus 273.15. But most teachers and professors will drop to 0.15, and it'll just be plus 273. So just adjust accordingly, depending on what you've learned in class. Degrees Celsius, on the other hand, is degrees Kelvin minus 273. I have a diagram right here that simplifies how to convert between Celsius and Kelvin. Celsius add 273 to Kelvin, and then Kelvin subtract 273 to get back to Celsius. Now let's take a look at a couple examples. Negative 15 degrees Celsius, we have to convert that to Kelvin. So from degrees Celsius to Kelvin, you just add 273. So we'll add 273 to this, and we'll get 258 degrees Kelvin. Then we're going from 300, <coughs> 300 degrees Kelvin to degrees Celsius. So we're going to opposite direction, Kelvin to Celsius. We just subtract. 273 and we'll get 27 degrees Celsius. Next we have negative 273 degrees Celsius and we're converting to Kelvin so we'll just add 273 degrees and that will give us 0 degrees Kelvin which is actually absolute 0 so that's the coldest temperature um, ever. And then lastly 1280 degrees Kelvin to get to degrees Celsius so Kelvin to degrees Celsius just subtract 273 and we'll get a thousand and seven degrees Celsius. Now, that's how you can easily d convert between degrees Celsius and degrees Kelvin. Degrees Celsius plus 273 to get to Kelvin, and from Kelvin to subtract 273 to get back to degrees Celsius. If you want to learn how to ace chemistry, if you want to learn what's the best way to study for this class, if you want to learn some neat tricks and tips to take into your exam and do better on them, then you should head over to my website and get this free guide. 12 Secrets to Ace in Chemistry, you can head over to www.conquerchemistry.com slash chemsecrets. I'm going to include a link in the description below. Check it out. I think it's really going to help you, and you're going to, you're going to like it. Until next time, keep working hard, and continue the good work.